Hap Hap, it's your boy, Mr. CJU, Mr. Critic Consultant. Hey, shout out to Iconic Television for making this happen, for us to kick some of this CJU game out to you guys. So, the last video we kicked game about how to build your credit profile with secure cards, the organic way, which is a good strategy. What we're gonna talk about in this video is one of the biggest strategies in the credit game, which is authorized user. Okay, the game that's gonna be kicked in this video is literally worth thousands to you if you don't know about it. It can be literally worth thousands. So, what is authorized user and why it's such a big deal? Authorized users is basically you piggybacking off somebody else's credit history and somebody's credit profile. So, let's just say you know somebody. How at your mama, your daddy, your aunt, your uncle, um, your grandma, hell, somebody just old. So you just know somebody old who has an old credit card that's open, that's active, and you want this credit card to be at least five to seven years or older, you know, older than that, at least 5K or more credit limit on it, and it must have 100% payment history. So if you know somebody who got an old card that's about seven years or older, 5K and up credit and 100% payment history, you holler at them and say, hey, add me as an authorized user to that card. I'm trying to build my credit. So what happens is all that history that that person had with that card jumps on your credit profile. See, there's nothing you can do in the credit game that can boost your credit age and add that credit limit that fast. You see what I'm saying? That's the key, so this is how it works. I'll give you an example of one of my students who used this strategy and increased the credit score tremendously. So this would happen. One of my students, after we repaired her credit, you know, got all the negative stuff off, I told her about this strategy. She said, Chris, I know my mom, she has an old Chase card. I'm sure I can ask her to add me. Cool, so what happened is her mama had a card. Um, let's just say this is the card. The card had a 10K limit on it. The card was um, 15 years old. You know what I mean? And well, it was open in 2004. The card was open in 2004, so it's 15 years old. And the card also had 100% payment history. When she told me that, I was like, perfect. Add her, tell her add you. So what happens is all you do is have that person call up the bank, say, hey, I want to add so-and-so as an authorized user. They're pretty much going to ask for whoever you add a name, um, date of birth. There's not a lot of information, just a couple of uh, personal information, and boom, they're added. And then they're going to make a duplicate card of this card to give to the, ad the authorized user, the person that's been added on. But you don't need the card. You know, you don't need the card. All you want is this to report to your credit profile and the credit bureaus will usually report it. Uh, you wanna make sure all three credit bureaus report this over when you're getting added. You want all three of them to add. So what happened is, once we repaired, uh, got the negative stuff off, she didn't have any established credit. So hers was, um, she had like a 550 uh, credit score. So she had, a, she had a 550 credit score. So even though we got the negative off, we got to build it up. But when this trade line hit, magic happened. This is how powerful it is. Her credit score went from 550 over to 740 just when that hit. Because she instantly, she went from having zero and she had no credit card, she had nothing. She went from having no credit age and no established credit to now all of a sudden, she ended up getting 15 years, 10K card with 100% payment history added. That boosted her up um, 190 points. This, big, this is a big deal. That's a big deal, 190 points. And you'll see I'll post also on my Instagram, um, this actually profile, I'll show you real proof. There's nothing in the credit game that can get you a 190 point increase. I don't care how many collections you take off, I don't care how many inquiries you take off, I don't care how many negative bank loans, I don't care what you repost, whatever take off, 
nothing to get you a jump like this like an authorized user that's how strong this is now the, the how high the points go up is all depending on how old the card is and pretty much the limit you know what i'm saying so if the card was maybe only five years old only six years old it might not have that high of a jump because credit age is a, is a nice chunk of your credit profile you know what i mean it's, it's a big it's a pretty big deal so because it was so old and 10k is pretty it's pretty good and 100 percent payments it got her this big jump you see what i'm saying so that little quick information is worth a lot because so many people have no idea this is even possible and you can make this happen with a phone call bam now what happened is once we got this credit score 740 she still had to go get her own credit you know what i'm saying even though this is authorized user but because this helped her so much i told her to go in and apply for some cars so then she called me she's like hey chris i was able to get approved she uh caught an amex card she scooped up an amex card um we waited a little bit she backed door and said hey chris i seen her the other day she said hey chris i just got approved for a city card city bank card and they shot her some money um, I can't remember how much her limits was, but they shot us some money. But she was able to get established for Amex and City real quick based off that uh, credit score, which came off this trade line. So, like I talked about in the other video, the secure card helped you build up organically, which you can still use, or you can just piggyback off somebody else's to help you get in the game real quick. And then, boom, once the bank see that this file is here they're gonna be like hey we'll shoot you some bread even though some bank lenders can see that it's an authorized user they'll still look after you and um they'll still look it up and still shoot you some bread if you don't have anything negative on it so she went from once the 740 here from that then she established her own two cards she's listening to everything i'm saying keeping the utilization low making a little small payments as we continue to build up her credit score ended up going up 40 more points now she's at a 780 this all happened like that with the score going up but we had to start repairing but she's one of my a students because she was smart enough to jump in this game with me we've been doing working on her stuff since 2017 giving her the game and a lot of information she didn't wait to the last minute she jumped on it quick and caught all this game figured it out and used it to her advantage now she's out here popping at a 780 building her credit and she's been beyond to go do whatever she want to do she want to get a car she want to get a house she want to leverage whatever she good to go so take this information start snooping around your people some old people hey let me see that let me see that coat let me see that credit card let me see that profile see what your people got going on make sure they fit this criteria i explained in this video and see if you can jump in on them i got some new students who come in and using this now um, if you don't know anyone, that's okay, because people actually sell trade lines. You know what I mean? That's what these are. These are trade lines. Authorized user trade lines. So I actually have a business partner that I work with. That as you go through my program, I send you over to them. They have trade lines available, and what happens is you can purchase them. You know what I mean? You can actually purchase trade lines. You know what I mean? There's, people have different prices. People have different packages. You can buy a trade line that's four or five years old. You can buy a trade lines that's 10, 20 years old. You can buy a trade lines that's 10,000. You can buy a trade lines that have 20,000 on the limit um, with different banks. Um, it's a whole different things. You know what I'm saying? That goes on when you're purchasing trade lines um, that you want to be aware of when you're going that route. You can come through our system. We'll give you more coaching on that and what to look for when you're going to do it. But it can work. You know, if someone is, is charging, you know what I mean? Because they, they, some can be pricey, but let's just say someone charged uh let's say someone charge charge you six hundred dollars let's say someone charge you six hundred dollars for this trade line right to post on your account say it wasn't her mama she actually had to pay six hundred dollars well that's cool you pay six hundred dollars for this trade line which shoot your credit up this high and then you back though apply to these banks and let's say amex shoot you 2k let's say citibank shoot you 2k now you you got these two credit cards and you established these two banks so basically you took 600 dollars for this trade line to post and then you got 4k out of it 
Sounds like a deal, doesn't it? You got your money back, and you you good with two banks. And you know, once you get in with these banks, I can show you how to build more. Then you know we gonna get, you know we gonna get us a Chase card. You know we gonna get us a Discover card. You know when you rock with uh when you rock with CJ, you we run it up. We gonna get all the credit. We gonna get all the banks. You know what I'm saying? So you can turn a six hundred dollar trade line over to four K, even though if they're expensive, say she charged you one K, a thousand dollars, a thousand dollars for this trade line. Okay, you still up three. So you gotta understand this credit game or anything in your life as you begin to expand and do your thing, you gotta look at how to leverage your money. You know what I'm saying? And these are investments in yourself. Put the bread up, you gonna get it back. See what I'm saying? So, I want to drop this game on y'all on one of the biggest plays in the credit game, which is authorized users, which can boost you up and get you popping in this credit game a lot faster once you know the knowledge. It's your boy, Mr. CJU. Holla back, hap, hap.